Hey guys, it's Lovable Chevy. Just wanted to show you my new project. This is the Handiness. It is a Nintendo portable using a Nintendo top loader. Uh, let's see, it's all nice and, and pretty. It's known as uh, the code name Red Mushroom, which put a nice mushroom on the back and it kind of looks like a red mushroom. So uh, that's why it's got white buttons on it and stuff. But anyway, a uh, quick overview it has a three and a half inch screen. Um, buttons from an FC twin controller. This is the volume. These are the screen controls and this is the on off switch. Down in you probably um, down in there there's a hidden switch underneath the, the post that is to switch between um, uh, player two or zapper using this nice USB port right here. Uh, this is the AC power jack, this is AV out, and this is a headphone jack. Uh, so, yeah, it's a pretty simple uh, explanation as to what it is. So, that is that, and um, some size comparisons the uh, to the Handy Duo, my first project. It's a lot smaller. It's also less than half the weight of the Handy Duo. This is only one pound, and the dimensions, it's two inches by... This is four inches, and this is six inches. Um, and the Handy Duo is obviously a lot bigger than that. I don't remember its dimensions from memory, sorry. Uh, the original Game Gear, it's mostly smaller than, it's a little bit thicker than, but otherwise the rest of the dimensions are smaller. The screen, uh, three and a half inches, they're about the same size, but obviously better quality here. And the, the DS which is obviously a lot smaller because it's a current one, but still three and a half inch screen. So, all right. So, uh, there's not a lot to say to describe this one. It's pretty basic. Only one cart slot this time. I know, I know I went really simple this time. What can I say? Anyway, um, I will, uh, where did I put the games? Okay. I will show it in action, hand the camera off. So it's held still. Here you are. Let me grab a game. Gonna play uh, Super Mario Brothers. Uh, get situated. Okay. Can you see it okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. And my sound has issues sometimes. So, uh, as you can see, it works. Um, here, see that. The, uh, I don't know if you can tell in these pictures or not, but I had a major accident the last day fixing it up right there. An X-Acto knife went straight through from the backside all the way through and into my finger. So, uh, it would take weeks to fix, and I'm just not all about that right this moment. I've already taken weeks to get it finished, so... So that's why it's not a perfect case, but otherwise, that is, uh, oh yeah, I should show you. I, since they're USB port, this is my second player controller, it's painted red and white with, uh, the USB connection, and then my zapper, which is also red and white with the nice mushroom there, and it's also for USB, which is over there on the bed, but... All right, so um, that is the uh, red mushroom or the handiness. I will get uh, another video going to show the uh, AV out along with the USB port and action and stuff to show that this all does work. So, uh, so yeah, thanks.